According to Kajiado residents, sleeping hungry has become the order of the day. They are now calling on well-wishers to donate food as well as safeguard their livestock, which are at the verge of succumbing to hunger. Unajitaidu kuenda pale na pale ntio watoto wasikoze chakula, lakini hali ya nyumbani sasa ni kubaya sana. Ata ngombe, ngombe zimeanza kuinuliwa, wengine wameanza kufa, pia ata, ata mbuzi, wote tunalisha. Kila mmoja ukiwakuta, uki unakuta wazazi ama watoto, wako juu ya, ya miti, waki taftia mifugo chakula kwa sababu kuna ncha sana. On their part, herders say feeding cattle using hay is no longer sustainable and they are at the verge of losing all their livestock considering hay prices have escalated to 350 shillings for a bale of 8 kilograms from the previous price of 80 shillings during the onset of the drought. Tunaomba mtusaidie tena mtulete nyasi ya ngombe kwa sababu kiangazi ni mingi. Watu wako na ncha, ngombe zikona, zinakufa kwa sabu ya ncha. Na tumeshukuru, hata watu wa shule, hata usaidizi tunaomba tu shuleni. Kwa sabu hata watu wa, 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 wako na ncha tu kama sisi. Selling livestock could be one of the solution. However, a cow that was selling at 70,000 shillings eight months ago is now selling as at low as 8,000 shillings, making it hard for them to sell at such a big loss, considering this is their main source of livelihood. Imagine how the Maasai depends on their livestock. And so and I want to say thank you to the friends of the Maasai for this small donation. People have really appreciated. And, and uh, about, I want to call upon organizations to come and partner with us and maybe we can help our community, not only this community but other villages. And in terms of their livestock, maybe we can look for a solution. Maybe we can give them some grass that they will feed on them. The county government of Kajiado, through the emergency kitty, has set aside 130 million shillings to mitigate the hunger effects of drought and food worth 75 million has already been distributed to vulnerable families. I'm receiving in my office many of the people. They are coming calling for help. And today, because the little help today we have seen, I appreciate this one. And the people that are, they are calling all over, if there is can be able to be increased uh, feeding of the people, it, it is, it is good, and, good and better. There is a lot of drought in Kajado and uh, we saw that uh, people are crying, people don't have food. So through the Friends of Maasai we were able to give this food, it's not a lot, so I'm calling upon other organization to come and help people. According to a survey conducted by the county in conjunction with other non-governmental organizations, at least 450,000 cattle risk succumbing to hunger. Robbie Omondi, K24 Newscut.